Okay, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait. Big Mac, you're going to have to make a decision at some point because you are literally out of Africa right now. You know what? There was no quitting me when I was a skip champion. There's no quitting me now. Yeah, but well, we've been playing for like six hours, so if you could make a decision, that would be great. Okay, you know what? Fine. How about wrestling? I'm not going to wrestle you, Big no, Mac. No, no, no. Black Widow and Carly. Yeah, I'm not going to wrestle them either. No, no, no. I'm talking about the best of Lucha Cut Season 1 with Black Widow and Kong Lee. Oh, okay. So the matchup between Black Widow and Kong Lee. The singles matchup from Season 1. No, season they one. are. No, they All right. You know what? Yeah, I'm, I'm up for that. I'd much rather watch that matchup than continue this game. All right. You know what? Never mind. I think I have a move. Right. And making his way down to the ring is Kong Lee, the mysterious figure from halfway across the world, looking really to make his name for himself in North America. And he's got himself an interesting singles matchup tonight against the always deadly and formidable Black Widow. Now, th this is a kind of a confusing match for me. I mean, we got the mysterious Orient. I'm here from the East to take the West. Kong Lee going against the Black Widow. Now she's dangerous and deadly, but this seems like kind of an odd mismatch, does it not, Michael? Well, it's, it is an intergender matchup. And I got to tell you, though, even so, Black Widow has proven herself to be deadly, diabolical, and highly skilled. So I'm not sure how much of a mismatch this truly is. Now, you know, it's weird because you said deadly, diabolical, and highly skilled. I didn't hear you say uh, wonderful, appreciative, and sexy. That's weird because I'm you're saying one thing, I'm hearing another. Let's not, let's not forget the final points. Well, Mac, I'm also not trying to hit on the Black Widow like you are. I'm so. not hitting on anyone. I'm pointing out her 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 uh, assets, I'm if not, you will. I'm and not, they are ample, if I might say. I'm not reading your fan mail. so. Uh, that, oh, I go through her me. trash can one time. You'll have to forget that. One time I go through the trash can, and you keep bringing it up. But you got to give Black Widow a lot of credit. She takes on any adversary. She takes on any challenge at this point. So you got to give her a lot of credit for taking on Kong Lee tonight. Now, when you say Black Widow, are you are you applying she's single? But possibly. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm saying because you said that's widow. Generally, what what widows are. Well, I'm saying you said widow. I'm not saying you say she's single. I'm not mad about that. I'm just I'm just pointing that out. Yeah, showing off the flexibility is Black Widow. Showing off that sinister nature, and we'll see she, what she's got in store for Kong Lee tonight. Now you, you say sinister. I, I say a class act. Clearly, there, there's, a, there's a language discrepancy between you and me, Michael. Uh, clearly, because you have a, a very specific uh, language that you use for Black Widow. Yeah, it's called the I'm English not, language, I'm but not you're sure welcome. I, that one. I gotta tell you. And you. I can tell you in Spanish, too. Uh, Como's Technicos way. Yeah, there you go. Same thing. All righty. Well, if you can compose yourself for the matchup, that would be fantastic. Tell me, I am fully composed. I'm sure you are. And Hippie Ramirez is going to get us kicked off for this one-on-one -on -one mono e matchup. I'll tell you, this is going to be an interesting fight. Uh, possibly a fight for the ages. We'll see what happens. I'm a little worried for Black Widow. I'm also a little worried for Kong Lee. I'm excited to see how this goes. Well, Black Widow now... Kong Lee, well, oh, a push from behind by Black Widow. Taking it to Kong Lee. She, can get. she is a true Black Widow, taking advantage of her prey. Oh, big shots to the back of the head. Dragging Kong Lee across the ropes, just scraping his face across the ropes. Sending him into that turnbuckle down forearms to the side of the head. Are you saying the Black Widow is dragging him across her web? I'm saying that she's using whatever advantage that she can get. That's what I'm saying. Well, that's the way to do it. I will not begrudge her for that. All right. The shot across the chest of Kong Lee got him shaken up. Now he oh. him again for another shot with a big backhand. Black Widow is taking her prey to task. Oh, and she's, she's talking to him. What's going on here? She's, is the crowd a problem for her? I say she seems to be creating. Oh, oh with a shot. Oh, in the regions of Kong. Lee. A little too far, Black Widow. A little too far. Yeah, she's using that women's intuition. A little scrambled eggs for his for his business, huh? She's trying to do everything that she can to gain an advantage in this matchup, and now Kong Lee taking exception to it. He's got her arm hooked behind her back now, really trying to work that submission. 
Black Widow now getting clipped into the ropes. Kong Lee's got her up, up over the shoulder. Oh, oh come on, Kong Lee. Slam. Be a gentleman. She is a lady. Be a gentleman. Big slam from Kong Lee. Now working back, Black Widow into the corner. Oh! oh what a big shot across the chest to Black Widow. He's continuing to work her into that, that rope. Holding her for that submission gets the count. Now I know Black Widow can hold her own, but come on, Kong Lee, what are you doing? Now Black Widow's got her up top. Oh! oh to a DDT. Counter to a DDT, and that might be it. One, two, oh! oh. And the kick, out, and the kick out. Gets the shoulder up. And Black Widow nearly taking advantage of that opportunity. She's going, she's going up high, it looks like. Now Black Widow on that outside. Going up top to the top of the turnbuckle. I think she's about to put an end to this little scuffle they got going on. And Black Widow up in Noah's side. Oh, oh outside, the outside the ring! Outside the ring! Crashing atop of Kong Lee on the outside of the ring. Sending his head bouncing off of that concrete. Black Widow, she is holding her own. She oh. might have this in the bag. Ippy Ramirez begins the count as both competitors on the outside. Now she's pulling up Kong Lee. Looks like she's going to whip him oh! the ring his head bouncing off of that ring post. Good night, Kong Lee. I'll see you back in the Orient. Now Kong Lee, oh, gets another shot across the shoulder. And Black Widow really starting to turn up control of this matchup. Black Widow, she is fully in control. Now she's calling her shot. Another oh! Whipping Kong Lee into the ring post. How much damage, how much can he take? From the Black Widow. Black Widow continues to work. Big knees to the body. Big forearms to the back of Kong Lee. Rolls back into the ring to reset the count. Wisely doing so to prevent the count out. Look at that. You got beauty, brains, and brutality. And that's what I'm talking about there, Michael. Yeah, she very well may have the total package. Now, both competitors back into the ring goes for the cover. One. Two, and a kick out from Kong Lee. Kong Lee still has a fight left in him. He's taking a brutal beating from a sadistic opponent. All right, Black Widow continuing to roll with the momentum. Whipping Kong Lee into the ropes. Goes for the clothesline, misses, comes up. Oh! A super kick to the face. She ain't a super kick for her trouble. A brutal kick to Black Widow. He's come out, Kong Lee. Oh! Oh, but a super kick of her own. A little, how do you do? A little, a little tit for tat, if you will. Yeah, Black Widow. Oh! Eats a clothesline. And now both competitors trading shots. And she and is forth. stalking him like he's oh. prey. And a big shoulder forearm shot, knocking Kong Lee to the ground. And Black Widow trying to reassert her control over this match. Oh, oh double oh. clothesline! Double clothesline! Both of them are down. Both competitors down in the center of the ring as Hippie Ramirez starts to count. Who can get to their feet first? The brutality! And that might be Kong Lee! Kong Lee is up. Trying to get back to his feet. Black Widow crawling to the ropes. Trying to get a little bit of leverage to get up. It looks like both are back up to their feet. Both, both are dazed. Off. Dazed and confused, but they're still fighting it out. Ooh, big chop to Kong Lee across the chest. And he doesn't seem to take too much exception to that. He seems to be fine. Now he wants to trade. Oh! A little bit more damage there, but Black Widow seems to be holding her own. Now they're going to they're gonna be reserved to trading. Oh! Chops across the chest, back and forth. Ah, Kong Lee wants another. Oh! Wants to deliver another. Black Widow wants to deliver another two. They're playing a little game of chicken here. Black Widow seems to be getting frustrated. Seems to have a little bit of anger going. Now she's doing multiple slaps. Oh, Kong Lee. He doesn't feel like he can get challenged by her. Shoving her to the Oh, oh this might be it. Oh, I thought he had. Oh! oh, oh, oh. I thought he had the pin count, but said he had a kick to the head to shot the Black Widow. Shot to the dome of Black Widow, knocking her out of the ring. Black Widow seems dazed, trying to trying to trying to get her composure going, but she's going in the ring. What's going on? Oh, and I should think she's bringing a chair. To the Still ring. chair. What's going on? 
And here Ramirez talking to Kong Lee. Black Widow trying to compose herself on the outside of the ring. She did throw that implement in. It's another chair. What you trying to do here, Big Mac? I don't know. What, maybe she wants to bring Kong Lee down to size. She's just putting chairs in the ring to give herself a, a bit of advantage. We'll see. Uh, she seems like she's nursing a bit of an injury there, but still collecting implements. It's hard to tell what her, what her strategy is here. She doesn't want to get disqualified here. Well, Ramirez has one chair. What's, what's going on here? He's trying hard to take those chairs away from the Black Widow. Uh, Black Widow, he's, he's trying to fight for that one. He's, he's collecting the other chair to throw it out. Black Widow's got that chair. She's What's she going to do? What's she thinking? Wait, she's stalking it. What, what, what just happened? What just happened? Did Kong Lee just hit her with a chair? Kong Lee didn't hit her with a chair. Kong Lee just hit Black Widow with a chair. Yeah, yeah. That coward. Yeah. You go, this coward. Happened. He just hit Black Widow with a chair. And Hipper Ramirez has no choice. He has no choice but to disqualify Kong Lee with a gunless coward. He just attacked Black Widow with a steel chair. You gunless coward. Okay, Mac, you obviously were watching this. I just saw what happened. I just saw it. Close to that happen. She was fighting. She was doing the right thing. Kong Lee, that coward, grabbed the chair, and he hit the Black Widow like the coward he is. And he got disqualified for being a coward. Good for you, Black Widow. You deserve that win. I, I would say that Black Widow won the Academy Award. But Big Mac, I think you win the Academy Award for biggest oversell of something that didn't happen. I win the Academy Award what? for being awesome and for the truth. And the truth is, you saw it. I saw it. The crowd yeah. saw it. Hippie saw it. Cogley hit her with a chair, and he deserved his call. Good for you, Black Widow. I saw the biggest. The ref camp does not lie. Look at that. Cogley's holding the chair. Damn, nothing. Black else. Will's in the corner in pain and agony. Wow. The ref camp does not lie. Wow. Okay. Well, I got to tell you, the video evidence doesn't support that. So You I just guess. saw it. No, I just saw nothing. Good for you, nothing. Black Widow. Black you did Widow the right thing. You fell your heart out. Cogley's a coward and a cheat. Good for you, Black Widow. You deserve that win, and you earned it. Come on, come on, come on. I got, I got this, I got this. Yeah, you know, I, I got to tell you, Mac, uh, I don't think you're going to be able to defend South Africa for the rest of the night. It's been seven hours hey, now. Hey, so. hey, I have a plan, and, and it's, around. oh, 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 no, oh, it's ruined. We'll never know who won. Yeah, we'll never know who won with that one yellow piece. Right it there. is a mystery. I know. Let's just go ahead. Yeah, I'm, there I'm, you go. I sounded. There you go. We're great. I, uh, I'll tell you what, it's not a mystery. It's the, it's the match of Plan Z versus Ironfly. Well, that's not a mystery. That's not. You know what? I got to tell you, that was actually a top notch match from season one of Lucha Frontera. So I'm willing to check that one out. There you go. So it's a tie. It's a tie. All right, making his way down to the ring. It is not plans A through Y. It is none other than the maniac himself, Plan Z, now making his way down to the ring. He's got that energy. He's got that high-octane attitude, and he is ready to impose his will on whoever gets in his way. You say energy. You say high-octane attitude. He's insane. He's a psychopath. He's a killer. That, that, that's not energy. That's insanity. Well, now he's he, apparently, despite all of his uh, transgressions, he's actually uh, pretty, you know, the, pretty popular among our younger fans. And there he goes up to the top turnbuckle. He's amped up. He's jacked up. He is ready to go. Well, now you got to love the fact he's a maniac. You got to love that a little bit. He's a maniac. You, you got to enjoy his passion at least. He's got that passion. He's got that energy. He is keyed up. He is ready to go. He is focused like a lightning bolt. And I'd hate to be his opponent in the ring tonight. If he's that focused, can you imagine having that insanity focused on you as his opponent? That'd be, that'd be terrifying. Well, his opponent, he's not one to shy away from any kind of a challenge. He's not one to shy away from anyone, no matter how crazy, no matter how psychotic. Iron Fly takes on all challengers, takes on any adversary. He is a man of honor, a man of distinction, a man that likes to push himself. And you know what? I think he's just the right kind of an opponent for Plan Z. A man of honor, maybe. A man of integrity, maybe. A man who wants to push himself, why not? He's obviously a man with a death wish going up against Plan Z. Well, maybe he's just a man of courage who's like, bring it on. You can have all that brashness. You can have all that bravado. But guess what? You've got to back that up with some talent. you got to back that up with some ability. 
and we'll find out if Plan Z's got that tonight. Well, I'll give you that. Now, there's a fine line between courage and insanity, and maybe the Iron Fly has just a little bit of both. All right, the referee now getting us set for action, checking Plan Z, making sure everything is legit, checking Iron Fly as well, but of course, with the man of integrity, you don't really have to, to check to make sure that he's ready. Hey, integrity to go. being what it is, the ref is doing his job. Okay, he's just, he's just doing what he has to do. And the referee is now calling for the bell, and we are off. Both men circling each other in the ring. Both men stalking all our fans each other. Yeah, circling, they're stalking each other in that ring. I want to remind all our fans out there to follow us with even more action. You can find us on Instagram at hashtag Lucha Frontera and on Facebook at Lucha Frontera. Well, I'll tell you what. Follow us. We'll follow you. Who doesn't like to be followed? Uh, you like, strike uh, that. Never mind. I'm about to say, if it's, if it's Delilah, she doesn't want to be followed by you, baby. Oh, so. she was flattered, okay? She was flattered Just, by my creepy advances. Yeah, so, uh, keep telling yourself that. Why, well, as I told the judge, he didn't agree. Well, speaking of creepy advances, both men now going up to the turnbuckles, trying to call out for fan support. Oh! Plan Z's just had enough now. He's going to start working away. Plan Z, he said, hey, I want the crowd's heart. Never mind. He wants to rip out the heart of Ironfly and eat it for dinner because he's a maniac. Uh, Plan Z now chopping away to the body. Big shots now just biting him on the top he's of the head. He's eating him in the side of the ring. What is happening? He's actually trying to eat the Ironfly. Yeah, he's trying to devour the heart and soul of Ironfly, trying to demoralize him, boot to the face, just stretching him out. Plan Z now trying to take control of this matchup early. Well, Plan Z, he is bringing his A game, or should I say his Z game, into this fight to, to, to win at all costs. So Plan Z uses his Z game. What does he use after that at that point? He doesn't need anything after that. Z game is all he needs to win that fight. Uh, oh. Let's hope that's all he needs is he gets the drop kick on Iron Fly. Now go. Oh. Big Superman punch. And he goes for the cover. Hook One, leg. One two. two, and the shoulder up from Iron Fly. Not quite yet. Oh. Now big oh. vicious knee drops to the body from Z. And he is just showing a level of ruthlessness that we really haven't seen here at NEW. Well, he's, he's treating the iron fly. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. He's Keep treating going. him like something. He's treating him like a second class is. And now he's got him up on the ropes, choking him out. Now Plan Z just continuing to go to work. He has no respect for the iron fly. He's, he's just trying to devastate him right now. And I think it's that energy, it's that initial onslaught that iron fly's had a hard time. Oh! But now, now he's reacting to it. Got the big clothesline. Oh! Now, Iron Fly's asking him, I hope you do have more than just a plan Z. Now, Iron Fly starting to battle back. Oh, the shot to the hamstring. Caught him in the hammy for plan Z as he's clutching it. Say what now you he's... will. Maybe plan Z's crazy, but Iron Fly, he does have the heart. He may not be crazy, but he's got the heart as a champion. Now, Iron Fly, he's, he's starting to, you know, establish himself in this matchup. Not a moment too soon as he whips Plan Z across. Oh, oh and a big shot. Big shot to Plan Z. Caught him in the shin, flipped him over. Plan Z's hurt. He's injured. He's grasping that, that hamstring. He is injured. And now Ironfly perhaps going to take advantage of this injury. Just circling him and stalking him in the ring. Well, now Ironfly needs to take advantage of this. His opponent is injured. I know he's a man of honor, but take advantage of it. Oh! Oh, oh and Plan Z, maybe Ironfly being a little bit too timid here. Now Plan Z goes to work. Oh! oh my goodness. Big sling blade One, for Plan Z. One, two, and, and a kick leg. out. And the kick out. Oh, just, just a two count. Z now continuing oh. to on Ironfly. Raining those punches down. Those vicious blows to the head uh, of Ironfly. How much can he take? Now, just as a reminder, you can't use a closed fist in wrestling, so he did have that fist open, but still devastating with those shots. Well, he's crazy. I mean, he doesn't follow the rules. He, he writes his own rules. Right, he's got to follow, follow the rules to some extent, or he risks getting disqualified. Well, tell that to a maniac. A maniac doesn't follow the rules. Oh, right now it doesn't. Just, sorry, it looks like he needs to follow the rules. He's he's really in cruise control right now, just continuing to work on Ironfly. Oh, oh and big knee to the midsection. Goodbye to your ribs, Ironfly. You're a man of integrity. Now you're a man with no ribs. Now Plan Z just digging in with that headlock, 
really working it. Ironfly gets him. Oh, no! uh, out. Oh, counter. No! Oh, big super kick. Big super kick from Ironfly. Break your butt. Break your jaw. Good night, Plan Z. Plan Z now. He is on Dream Street. He is trying to wake up. Ironfly now going for the cover. Oh, this might be One, it. One, two, two and a and kick four. out. Gets that shoulder up. Oh, Pansy, he is as crazy as we thought he was. I can't tell if it's insanity or if it's heart or if it's guts, whatever it is. It's driving Z forward at this point. Oh, it, 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 it's crazy. It's insanity. You know that. He doesn't have a heart. He's insane. It's pure insanity. Oh, Z gets whipped. Oh, now, now Ironfly trying to hook that other arm. Get him up. Oh, he's got him stretched out there. Oh, oh my goodness. Big sit down. That might be it. Buster. One, two. Oh, oh, and a kick out. Unbelievable. He thing. is crazy. At the last possible second, he manages to get that shoulder up. And Ironfly is beside himself. He doesn't know what to do here. What How do you, do you beat do? a man who's so away? insane he doesn't know when to quit? And just in desperation, goes for another pinfall. Almost futility starting to sink in for Ironfly. How does he how does he possibly battle back? Get Z up on the shoulders. He's got him up there. He's looking. Oh, oh my goodness. Uh, a big sit down slam. And now he goes for another cover. Well, it looks like he was gonna go for a cover, but no, now he wants to go up top. He wants to put the exclamation point on it. He wants to make sure the next cover is the one that does it. Oh, oh uh, Z knocking the ropes, knocking. Iron Fly off balance. I hope the Iron Fly had the Iron Gonads because he just went to town. Oh. oh, and Z with a shot to the head. And now he's going up. Dangerous, high risk territory here. Oh, and he goes for the hurricane oh. right off of the top rope. My goodness. Z's got the cover. One, One two, two, and oh. a kick out. At the last possible second, Iron Fly gets that kick out. He gets that shoulder up. And now Z's beside himself. Now he can't believe it. I can't believe it. How did the Iron Fly kick out of that? I well, see both men demonstrating tremendous heart, tremendous guts in this matchup. Oh! Oh, shot to the midsection for, for Z. Now he's got the double underhooks. Now he's got him up, up, up. Oh, oh what a trip to crazy town. Compliments are playing Z. Face with Two, the three, oh, and that's the it. Oh. And that's it. Unbelievable matchup playing Z. Just pulling out all the stops. Gets that double underhook face buster to close out the match. And now you would think after that kind of war, he'd have no energy, but he keeps going. Plan Z, he's, he's just that crazy. He took him to crazy town. Population you. He is energized, and he is one to watch as we move forward. A man motivated, a man with, with the sky's the limit for his talent. It'll be interesting to see where he goes. All right, Michael, I have been beating you all night. It's okay, but I'm exhausted. I'm going to hit the hay. Well, you know what? Uh, I'm sure you're exhausted from all that uh, losing that happened earlier. But no harm, no foul. All right, so I'm differently, but okay. And you know what? we got to thank you for joining us. Season 2 of Lucha Frontera comes up very, very soon in a couple of weeks. And we're bringing you the best, boldest, and greatest matches better than ever. You know what? I think I thought I'm going to go ahead and sleep here tonight. Uh, I'll see you in the morning, and I'll see you in season two. Now, don't leave the door open again. I can't have the raccoons all over the house again. Come on now.